Hi everyone with Cape Fear Crew. I'm Andrea with Southern Sign Company. I've been a member of Crew since uh, early 2019 and I'm bringing to you our first edition of the audio visual recap of the monthly newsletter. If you're like me, your inbox makes you want to stab your eyes out, right? Um, and it's something I always intend to get back to, but never really make the time to do. So if you're, um, if you're interested, the hope is that I'm going to give you this recap. You can listen to me while you're driving in your car. You can uh, set this up while you are, you know, cooking dinner or getting ready in the morning. And then if there's highlights you want to learn more about, go find the newsletter and you're going to get some more details. So hang on to your seat. We're going to cruise through our January mid-month newsletter and uh, see what's going on, all right? So first, you know, we've got a, a wonderful president this year, Gail Wallace of Clarendon Properties, is at the helm for our chapter. And her messaging this month really is a lot about engagement and working hard with the committees to get some virtual and in-person events happening. Hopefully, you were able to join us last week at Waterman's Brewing. That was a great event outside. We've got lots of events coming up. I'm going to get into that. And then also, of course, there's lots of information in the newsletter, and Gail touches on it as well. Really excited about our third annual Awards of Excellence. I'm probably not going to get into too much of that because there's lots of detail in the newsletter you can go find. Um, but thanks, Gail, for uh, stepping up and being our leader this year. It's going to be great. So as far as programs and events, coming up in the month of February, we've got several things that you need to register for to participate. Some are in person, some can be done um, virtually, starting with uh, Tell Me About It at Big Sky Design as, and Studio. This is going to be a wine pairing and vignette. Uh, looking at different interior design uh, setups at her space. Or you can pick up your wine, register to do it virtually, pick up your wine at Palette the day before the event and do it online with us that way. But either way, you're going to have to register for that. But that is February 11th. So um, go to the newsletter and get, hit the link and do that. Um, on February 25th, the crew is doing networking bingo. So this is not bingo like you think of. We're not sitting around with little cards and chips and things along that those lines. And to be honest with you, I'm not really sure how it goes, but it sounds like fun. There's going to be raffle tickets. There's going to be winners. And who doesn't like to win, right? Um, we've got all kinds of things going on. The deadline to register for that is February 19th. That event is February 25th. Something that's important about this is that it's open to guests as well. So feel free to find some friends or um, acquaintances that you think might be great membership potential for our chapter and sign them up to come along. So that'll be February 25th. Um, deadline to register February 19th. And that can also happen through the crew. Uh, newsletter. Also coming up at the end of this month is a Saturday event. This is going to be in person. This is um, and that cycling event you've probably heard some people talk about. It's Recess by Bevan. She set up a cycling um, fitness class. And so by registering for this, it's a free, or sorry, the fee is $15 for our crew. So that's a special rate when you get the shoes and you get water. It's a 45 minute class. It's outside under a tent over at the Mayfair area. But a lot of us are gonna try it and see what happens. There might be a limit to the number of people. I'm trying to look here. There is a promo code in the newsletter, newsletter, excuse me, CF Crew. So you'll wanna put that in. Um, and you're going to be looking for that link in the February 15th newsletter to sign up for that event. But that should be fun. Apparently it's not as intimidating as it sounds, so let's get out and cycle. Oh, of course, I touched on the awards. We're still open uh, for a little bit, of, little bit more time for nominations, and I know that uh, Lannon and Andy are eager to get those nominations in, so they're always available with lots of great information, so if you need to reach out and find out if a project or a person fits a category, they'd be great to reach out to. As far as news goes, don't forget to renew your membership. You can do that through your um, your national crew mem uh, membership, the login that you did, and you get to the website. And if you don't know how to change your dang settings, for God's sake, so you don't get all their emails, you can do that in there. But you'll want to re-register and make sure your membership is current, of course. And at that time, you can also make a donation to the Crew Network Foundation. And this um, this nonprofit arm of crew um, specifically gives scholarships and things of that nature to help out. Last year we had 100% of our membership donate 
um, and that was really a great accomplishment for our group. So, and speaking of that, did you know that you can link your crew found the crew foundation to your Amazon Smile account, right? So I know we all have things that um, charities and such, schools, whatever else that we have connected to our Amazon shopping, um, but uh, Crew Foundation is actually one of those things. So um, there is a link in the newsletter as well. If you want to sign sign up and link your Amazon account, you can do that there. So what else do we have going on? Um, you will want to check into the newsletter to learn more about our new members, right? You might be reaching out to do some bus business, member-to-member uh, -member business. We've got Sue Meyer of Copycat, uh, Cassandra Bar uh, Barba of uh, Cape Fear Solar Systems, and uh, Penny Stith of Beacon Title Agency. So great to have new members joining even in this crazy time when we don't have too many in-person events and it makes it a lot harder. But it, that's great to know. Um, reach out to them. Their emails are here in the newsletter. You can reach out and just welcome them if you have a second um, or if you're looking to get some printing or want to learn more about solar or any of that kind of stuff. We've got some new connections for that information which is great. Um, what else do we have going on in the spotlight? Uh, our member spotlight this month is Kelly Stewart. And so if you do not know Kelly Stewart, um, she is a super impressive realtor, just crushing it in South Brunswick County um, and the surrounding areas. Her story is really inspiring to me. I just find it really impressive when I read her credentials and her history and her drive and how hard she's worked and all that she's doing to transform the commercial real estate landscape of uh, South Brunswick County. So take a look at that. It's really interesting to get these backstories on our members, things that people don't often bring up or, or we don't always have an opportunity to learn more about in person. So, um, and if you're interested in having a spotlight done on you, you can also share that um, through the through that specific committee. So you would use the info at capefearcrew.org. Just reach out and say that, let us know that you'd be interested in having a spotlight done. We'll send a questionnaire and things along those lines. Because we do really believe that it's important for the members to get to know one another and that we're learning more about um, the strength of our group, right? So let's see what else is happening. We've got in the newsletter, um, you know, that one of the things that's interesting is when members and uh, kind of come together and work together, and that's kind of how we got this recess with Bev and the cycling event, came together through the joint efforts of Julie Dixon at Live Oak Bank and Paige at Mayfair and Andy Mitwall with Mitwall Capital Group, um, kind of got together with Bev and Prince and put that together for us, so that's kind of exciting. We want to say congratulations to Rebecca Knudsen for being a named partner at CSH Law. That's pretty exciting. And of course, there's a link in here to check out our dynamic Terry Espy of Momentum Companies um, during the Greater Wilmington Business Journal Power Breakfast. If you don't know Terry or haven't seen her in action, also really impressive um, to see that happening. Um, let's see, Terry also, along with Julie Andrews, who is a past president for us, were named by the Wilmington Biz 100. Um, and that is a pretty influential list of the top power players, influencers, let's see, innovators, connectors, and rising stars impacting southeastern North Carolina. So come on, that's pretty great, right? Um, reach out to them and say congratulations. Also to Cheryl Nabel for being promoted to the agency president at Wade Associates. That's pretty amazing uh, deal. Big congratulations to Amy Wang on being named the bet one, one of quote, best lawyers in America by best lawyers for tw for 2021. And I don't know if it gets much better than that. Pretty great. So congratulations to everyone who are um, making leaps and bounds, still striving for greatness in your careers and, um, and still being recognized and uh, supported by your community. That's pretty great. Um, community involvement. Uh, there's a spotlight in here about Wilma's 2021 leadership Institute applications are open, but just till the January 31st. So if you want to do something like that, uh, one of the things that our chapter is really interested in is getting together with um, and learning more about GLOW um, and leadership, of course, for young women, promoting them to going to, you know, and going to college and secondary education. There's some information in that and stuff that will be coming up for a one-day volunteer opportunity at Habitat for Humanity as well for our chapter. So that's 
would be fun. Hopefully we can all bring some skills. One of the things I'm going to loop back around to the awards, this kind of weaves in and out of the newsletter, but the list of our partners, contributing partners, um, otherwise known as sponsors. So take a look at that list and make sure if you run into someone from those groups to thank them for investing in and supporting our, our event. Um, and that's kind of what's going on. So there you have it. See, half the time that it would take to sit down and read through everything. But if you want more details, go ahead, check it out. Um, it's all there with uh, links for registering for events, additional information about some of the stories. And I'll see you next month. Bye.